वेलकम टू दिस वीडियो लेक्चर लेक्चर नंबर टू लेक्चर टॉपिक एलमेंट ऑफ मेकेट्रॉनिक्स फॉर सेवन सेमेस्टर मेकानिकल इंजीनियरिंग मेकेट्रॉनिक्स सब्जेक्ट्स प्रेजेंटेड बाय डॉक्टर सी मनीवेल असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर मेकानिकल इंजीनियरिंग इन दिस टॉपिक्स वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द एलमेंट ऑफ मेकेट्रॉनिक्स सिस्टम बाई यूजिंग वेरियस एलमेंट how the mechatronic system is going to fulfill it to for the any application let us discuss one by one of the mechatron mechatronic system elements some of the elements may be constructed in a sequence manner to complete the mechatronic systems that elements are actuators and sensor signals and conditioning digital logic system software and data acquisition system computers and display devices these elements are arranged in a sequential manner based on the applications of mechatronic systems that applications may be functions with open loop system or the closed loop systems here the most of the mechanical systems classified under the category of actuators and sensors based on the elements present in the systems either in input or in output that mechanical systems construct based on system model that will produce dynamic responses that response output is given to us a input signal for further conditioning for the interface devices through this interface devices the input signals may be controlled in terms of digital that provided to the output signal for display unit or again to a mechanical systems if the output signal provided to a mechanical systems is called as a closed loop systems if the output signals directly provided to the display unit or the recording devices is called as a open loop systems uh, some of the major classifications between the sensors and actuators are displayed here um, the actuator produced motions are caused some accents sensors detect the state of system parameters inputs and outputs some of the actuators are pneumatic and hydraulic electromechanical actuators piezoelectric electrical motors that is dc ac stepper or servo motors categories some of the various sensors linear and rotary or rotational sensors acceleration sensors force torque pressure temperature proximity and light sensors these are the some of the sensors types it is classified based on its applications a collection of sensors are shown here in terms of uh, graphical or the functional images for our more understanding pneumatic and hydraulic actuation system the major component of actuating systems are hydraulic power supply or pneumatic power supply pump or compressor check valve accumulator pressure relief valve dcv or the directional control valve pcv or pressure control valve process control valve these are the main element consisting of actuating systems for both pneumatic and hydraulics 
the schematic symbol or providing a more understanding about the functions of actuating systems these elements arranged in a sequential manner to make it a functional systems mechanical actuating systems it provides based on the motions with the elements here the types of motions may provided based on the motions of degree of freedom that will makes from kinematic chain bar chain links slider crank mechanism camera actuations gear train mechanisms belt and chain drive mechanisms bearing motions etc electrical actuations electrical actuation systems consisting of uh, switching devices solenoids and drive systems switching devices are classified as mechanical switches relays solid state switches etc some of the mechanical switches are keyboards limit switches switches are categorized in this category relays it's consisting with the coils solid state switches classified as diodes thyristors transistors etc sometimes the switching directly is called as based on the functions of on and off the solenoid categories are push type or pull type solenoids uh, push something having with starter solenoid pneumatic or hydraulic valves etc the drive systems are categorized as either dc or ac or sometimes stepper or servo like this this how to achieve speed control in a drive system is controlled by using the drive systems in a any mechatronics systems signal and conditioning mechatronic systems de- deals with the two types of signal and conditioning that is input and output conditions the input devices receives input signal from mechatronic systems via interfacing devices on either sensor or the actuators from sensor the signal is sent to the control circuits for conditioning or further processing the various input signal conditioning devices are amplifiers analog to digital digital to analog converters or sometimes digital to digital converters etc the output signals from the systems are sent to the output or the display units through interfacing devices the various output signals are converted as either analog to digital or the digital to analog based on the requirements of output devices here the output signals may be converted by using of a to d or d to a transistor up amps like that here the digital thermometer functions in a mechatronic system is shown here here the thermocouple is a transducer that converts temperature to a small voltage 
the amplifier increases the magnitude of the voltage the analog to digital converter is a device that changes the analog signal to a coded signal in terms of digital form and the leds that is light emitting diodes displays the values of the temperature these mechatronic system applications uh, shown as a dotted boxes for more understanding as a various elements forms that starting from of the transducer that is thermocouple unit and the signal processing unit with the amplifiers and interfacing device of uh, a to d and display recorders that output unit is shown as a led display recorders here next one is digital logic system it will control overall system operation the various digital logic systems are logic circuits microcontrollers plc sequencing and timing controls etc here the some of the plc systems and the unit is so here for more understanding about the digital logic system plc system and its architecture the components arrangements of plc systems shown here this topic will discuss in detail manner for further lectures software and data question system data question system occurs the output signal from sensors in the form of voltage frequency resistance etc on inputting into the microprocessor or computer the software is used to, to control the occurrence of data through data question control board data question system consists of multiplexer amplifier register and control circuits some of the examples software of data question systems ladder logic visual c++ swell basic lab matlab lab chart or lx extra automatic temperature control using lab view software example shown here that images the shows for more understanding as how the lab view software helps to complete the mechatronic system applications that we can we can visualize it and get experience how to simulate it to uh, through the automatic controls next topic is computers and display devices computers are used to store large amount of data and process further through software display devices are used to give visual feedback to the user the display devices are LED, LCD, CRT, digital display, etc. Here, the uh, example images are shown for our understanding. Commonly available digital multimeters. It is used as a output devices as well as the measuring devices in a mechatronic system. another one is oscilloscope is a widely used in a recording devices as well as the measuring devices in a mechatronic system applications by using this mechatronics elements we will construct any kind of mechatronic systems for the applications some of the mechatronics system applications are 
discussed here for examples like ncc nc systems fms or ams systems automated guided vehicles prototypings and robots computer disk drives photocopiers laser printers and fax machines are the some of the examples of mechatronic systems dvd drives atm machines coin counters automatic camera digital watches also the examples of mechatronic systems for the functional units of aircraft flight control systems in that uh, especially a cockpit control landing gear controls are the examples of mechatronic systems in the automobile applications includes electronic engine management systems collision detection or avoidance systems global positioning systems abs that is anti lock braking systems are the examples of mechatronic application systems moreover in that automotive systems having that uh, cruise control parking assistance systems also comes under the category of mechanical applications in medical field especially for diagnostic instruments such as ct scan systems automatic uh, testing equipments are the examples of mechatronic systems automatic sliding doors vending machines and carriage door openers are examples of mechatronic systems aerospace applications includes launching satellites solar plate solar panels functions of mechanisms in various aerospace applications are comes under the category of mechatronic mechatronics applications so i hope that this kind of or any kind of mechatronic systems if we take for understanding about means we must considering the basic elements of mechatronic system which we are discussed here is presented in that systems thank you thank you for your patient listening